the zone. Okay, one more real quick. This is super quick. It just came to me. You know, when God speaks, I got a, you know, lightning bolt, right? The more you smile, the more you smile, the more you heal the world around you, the people around you. If you're in pain and you need a hug and you become that hug and you become that smile, find it. Find the smile for yourself, especially nowadays when people are going through a lot of trauma and, and you know, especially children. When you see a child traumatized or you know they're being traumatized, give them a hug. Just talk to them. Just, that's all they need is conversation. Being a counselor is as simple as listening to somebody, being able to hug somebody, being able to understand and be able to be in somebody's presence when they're in pain. Empaths are great counselors, and especially when it's the person that they're counseling is not trying to drain them. They're just, just in shock and in fear and scared and hurt. And your, your abilities, that's when your power shines because basically as an empath, you're giving them that love that they desperately need, right? With those people in Kentucky, they're still going to need lots of counseling. So they need people that are going to shine bright to come in and just give them hugs and, you know, tell them stories and make them smile and laugh. And if Because you weren't there, you're not in it. So you, you're, you know, you, were, you weren't at the trauma center at the time of the traumatic moment. So your ability to to not be traumatized while they're being traumatized and it helps that you know it's, it's hard to explain, but because you know but you've already been through it. Empaths usually have already been traumatized in the first place to get the power that they got. Let's put it that way, but uh, maybe that's what I was trying to say. Is you're already there. You've already been through it. Everything, you know, the dark night and the the pain and the suffering and the loneliness and all that fun stuff. So when somebody's in need, you're there. You, you, you can empathize. That's the key word. You know, you can put yourself in their perspective t and sometimes you can take that pain away. And, and that's, that's a blessing. Anyway, damn, I'm rambling. <laughs> it's like, come on, though. It's important. I'm just saying this is just probably the key power that we have is to hug and to love and to get people to smile again, especially children. We want them smiling all the time. Nothing funner than hearing a kid bust up laughing. That's my favorite. You know, you gotta love that stuff. Anyway, I love you. God loves you and the universe loves you. And shine bright and have a wonderful day. Okay, goodbye. Okay,